Hello, let's play a bunch of daily word games. I felt like playing GeoGuessr again, so we'll do a couple maps of that. It'll be at the end of the video uh, because it's not word game related. So we'll do all the word game stuff, stay primed with that. Then we'll do some GeoGuessr to top off the video. Uh, hope you enjoy that. Um, so let's start with place because you're trying to place where you are in the world. All right, um, let's move that E around for the right side. Um, let's try an ER word. Mm. I don't know what to do. Timer. Okay, it is an ER word. Wow, we got a lot of info on the left too. Um, I'm thinking T E R on the right, but the left. I think the left is. We're gonna get more info if we try for that. So could it be an I R E word? Shire maybe. Not an I R E word. Oh, we got an H on the right though. We might be able to figure out the right now. Um. Other? Ooh. Whoa, what what is, oh is it ether then? Okay, yikes. Um left side something R I something E. Oh no, there's a lot of those too. Uh what what would be a really effective filler here? I'm thinking things that would go forth and things that would go before the R. So D G N B maybe. Or there's already a lot of letters I need. I, I'm, this is going to be very luck based here at the end, even with the filler. Um, what can I do? I should probably test the R second too. Is something like brand a word? No. Uh, brand is a word. Let's try that. Wow, that was lucky. <laughs> I mean, I targeted the more common things that would, would happen, of course, but still got lucky. <laughs> Very lucky there. Okay. Well, let's move on. Let's do Fibble. Uh, okay. So in Fibble, every guess has a lie in the coloring. So one of these, one of these is lying. Could be one of these yellows, should have been green or gray. Could have been one of these grays, should have been green or yellow. Exactly one lie. Um, I'm trying to think. If we guess onion, I think that's going to really, really help. So let's deal with that first. And the, the lie is actually this O should have been green. <laughs> okay, so one of these ends is lying for sure. Um, that means there is an I in the word. That means there is no O in the word. If there was an O in the word, then we'd need some of these O's to be lying. But we we need two lies there, right? But there's already a lie in these ends, and there's only two lies total, so we can't have three lies. So because one of these ends is lying, we know there's no O in the word. This wasn't the greatest result of all time, but um, at least we we found there's no O. So here's the thing: if I if I wanted there to be an N in the word, there'd actually have to be. Uh, Oh no, what am I saying? Yeah, there'd have to be an M or an R as well. So maybe something like R I N. Uh what did I what, what oh I can't put the I in the middle though. Ooh, that makes it harder. So like like ending in I N and then including like an R somewhere, like R A I N. Ooh, okay. So something like grain. Actually, let's use our brain on this one. Okay, so what did we learn? The N is still gray. So it's doubling down on no N in the word. The I still hasn't become green. We have a lie between these R's. We know there's an I. We already knew that. But is there... Okay. Okay, we have an X-wing between the first guess and the third guess. And what I mean by X-wing is there's two lies total between minor and brain. One of them's in minor, one of them's in brain. That's two, that's two lies. But there's a lie between these two R's. So that's one lie. And there's a lie between these N's. That's another lie. So anything that's in those two guesses that's not an R or an N can't be lying, or we'd have three or more lies. So nothing, anything other than R or N is telling the truth. Now I'm thinking at this point that this N is the lie, there's no R or N, and then we have an I in the middle. But that one, guessing words like that wouldn't give us very much info. So is there any way that I can do the opposite for now and say there is an R and there is an N? Hmm. 
maybe at the end. And then I'd have to like start with I. I don't know. Um, okay, I'm, I'm just gonna do the I in the middle thing. <laughs> uh, stick. Okay, it doubled down on the yellow I there. Let's just do I in the middle again. We'll do TI. What, what do we put before the T though? Because we can't do an S in this case. Um, that might be hard. Because we don't have an A. Would we want to do an E there? I don't see how any, I don't see how this works actually. Um, in which case we do have an N. If this eye is telling the truth, we have to have an N somewhere. These lies are, are confusing today for sure. Um, I really thought brain was going to help, but more than it did. So this is what we were assuming. This R is lying which means this ends not, which means there is no N in the word, which means this I is lying, but there has to be an I, so there'd be an I in the middle. So then the rest of this would be true. And then also there's no N, so that's our lie. So we would literally have something TI something something. The other possibility is we actually have a bunch of letters in. Um, I'll look at that in a second. But I'm really trying to see if there's any way to do a TI word. ITI. No. ETI. Not seeing it. UTI. Like, like util? Okay. <sighs> Interesting result. All right, I'm going to I'm going to reset. I don't remember what's true and what's a guess. Um, so we have an X-wing here between the T and the I. So all of this has to be true. But also we know there's an I in the word because we had, even just between these two, right? we had these ends disagree. So there is an I in the word. One of these could have been lying as green, but they can't both be lying as gray. Um, so we know there's no O. We know there's an I in the word. We also had an X-wing between minor and brain. Let's, let's apply that too because one of the N's is lying, one of the R's is lying. So anything that's not an N or an R in these are not lying. So this has to be our lie. So that has to be our lie. So that has to be true. So there has to be an N in the word because one of these N's is lying. So there has to be an N. And if there's an N in the word, then this one's lying. So that's telling the truth, which means that one's lying, which means that's telling the truth. Okay. Now we don't know which of these ends is lying because it could be green in one of these spots, in which case that must be the lie. Otherwise, maybe it's yellow. So one of, this one's supposed to be yellow. Um, okay. So what did we learn? We learned that we start or end with I. Let's start with I. We learned that there's an E in the word somewhere. And then there's an R in the word somewhere. Uh, and then we learned there's an N. Is it just inner? Oh, it can't be because we can have N in the middle. Uh, infer? Wow. Okay. Yeah, that was tough. We had some nasty lies. Um, generally, statistically, lies are going to be the greens, then the yellows, then the grays. Now you'd think, well, there's an equal chance for anything to be lying, but gray is the most common coloring in any guess until you get near the end where you're, you're, you know, you're applying strategy and applying info you've learned, then, then you're, you're less likely to have grays in your guesses. But early guesses are most likely to have grays. And if a gray is, and, and, and so since you're going to have mostly grays in your early guesses, the lie is more likely to pick a gray and make it a yellow or a green. So if there is a green in an early guess, then that's the most likely thing to have been a lie because greens are the least common result. Um, and so that because it, you're more likely to that that letter was supposed to be gray or yellow. Um, and in this case, we got we had two yellows here that could have been the lies, and instead it was this gray R. And then in the next one, we had a gray N as a lie, even though there was a yellow I. And then a gray N lying again in brain in a different spot. <laughs> 
And then th this green T lying is statistically likely, but then we have this gray I. So a lot of grays lying today. That's that's unlikely. Really threw me off. But we got there. I think that was a decent solve. Just took a while. All right, let's play between all. I'll start with mouse. Okay, we are a little bit closer to mouse than we are to the end of the alphabet. Uh, this orange dot is telling us that in this 20 and 26. So let's let's split the difference. Let's start with like S. Let's do shore. Okay, pretty close to shore. Um, I'm thinking like let's try an S A word just to see if we're we're in the let's do sandy to stay on theme here. Sandy shore. Okay, so we might start with like S C or something like scare. Okay, I didn't go far enough actually. Maybe score then. Is that far enough? Let's find out. The too far, actually. Ooh. Uh, maybe something like S C O O, like scoop. No. Oof. Okay. S C O is forced. Um. Maybe another O. Okay. So scoop. We can literally count because there's like three or four words after scoop, and then like two or three words before score. Um. So 0.01% would be scoot. And then I don't see another OO. So I think we have to go after OO. So maybe something like scope might might work better. There it is. Perfect. Nice. Got it in seven guesses. How'd you do? All right, let's do polygonal. We have a six letter word today. And there's one repeated letter, but it repeats twice in all of these slots. Um, what do I want to put here? Probably like an SSES, so like, I don't know, gases or something. Nope, not that. Okay. There's an E and an S, though. Uh, would it be like, I don't know, like geese, but two letters in front? What would that be? Is some, something, oh, cheese. It would be cheese. Oh, nope, apparently not. Okay. Uh, maybe sneeze? Ooh, that would be fun. It was sneeze. Nice. I've been doing that a lot lately. Okay. How many options were there? 95 words, 31 ordinary. Ooh, kisses. <laughs> All right. Oh, wheeze. Wheeze would have been fun. Um, we had the S, though, so it couldn't have been. All right. Let's do the mini. All right. These two repeat. Um, what should I do here for these repeating? How about, how about Chuck? Oh, okay. So the CCK was correct. Something like clack or <laughs> crack. <laughs> Maybe should have done crack before clack. I don't know. I mean, I guess they were equally likely to be the answer. Um, yeah, lots, lots of words. All right. Let's do symbol. I'll start with blaze. Might end in E. We test that with rouse. We do end in E. The second letter is not an O, but instead is an R, U, or S, because that's how yellows work in symbol. And we, we've identified what all of these are now. The, or, the orange pentagon is, a, is gray for sure. The green infinity has to be green, because I tried E twice in that slot, and it was twice the same symbol and, and not the gray one. And then, so that leaves yellow, to the yellow cube to be yellow. And the way yellows work in symbol is it means a different letter in the word goes in that slot. So it's the R, U, or S, because the E was already used as the green. So maybe the vowel, maybe we do something like this, if I can think of something. Um, I don't know. I mean, we R, R, R likes to be second a lot. So we can do, no, there's plenty of words. Let's just do drive to start with. All right, I was right about the R, just not any of the other supporting letters. So, uh, what? Oh, ooh, what are we putting as a vowel? We tried A E I O U, so it's probably another E then, and it can be another E because the E's just been green the whole time. So there could be a second one earlier. Um, something like cream, exactly like cream. Nice. I feel like we were we were down to very few options there because of all the vowels missing. Cool. All right, let's do blind fusel. We have to, uh, our first twist is that we have to start our, our, our starting or sorry, our, our guess has to have a repeated letter. What am I saying? 
So we'll start with start, which has a repeated letter. All right. This next twist, we're going to get um, Wormel-like hints. So in each slot, we're going to have a clue on whether that letter is close alphabetically to the answer, within three uh, distance. So I don't know, maybe I'll just try tangy. All right, so what we learned is that this is a T, this is an N. This doesn't mean there's no A in the word, it just means this letter's not an A. So I don't know, the A goes over here somewhere. Um, now this twist, I have to guess anything but a real word. So there's no point in bringing the greens down, but I'd, I'd like to think about what the answer might be so that I can do a, a filler word that, that grabs the letters I think we might want to try. Um, I'm almost thinking we end in A, but like what goes here? Could it be, oh, this isn't a G. Um, what would this be? Maybe, maybe this would be A and then, oh, it could be just tonal. Okay. Let's test for tonal. So I'll actually just put these in the right spot and then let, let's just get other letters, maybe just the other vowels. Let's get the I and the U just to check. Okay, it's tonal. <laughs> Got it. Nice. All right. I'm not sure if there was much left, much else left, to be honest. With a TN in place there and an A not second. Cool. All right, let's play Don't Wordle. Uh, it is thinking of a secret word, and we are trying not to guess it. So I'll start with kayak. All right, we have a yellow A, so we'll do pizzazz, because we have to keep using the A. Ooh, we have a P in the word. All right, we're already pretty limited with 106 words left. That's very tough to do in four guesses, but we can at least try to figure out what the word is and not guess it, and then undo. So it could be something like clamp. It could be something like champ. Um, what if I guess, oh, I was going to guess a part, but the problem is that we can't do a repeated A, because kayak, we already tried a repeated A. Um, it could be something like an APE word, maybe, like like scape. I'm going to guess scape. Oh, OK, so we're an SPA word, which I hadn't really considered. Uh, spank is an option. Um, spark is an option. Um, I wonder if like spall is a word. Ooh, it is. Ooh, it's not SP. OK, so it's S something A something P. Oh, so it could be swamp. It could be stamp, and then there's one more. Um, could it be something ARP? Sharp. It's literally those. I could gamble it. <laughs> is that fun? Is it fun to gamble it? Or is it more fun to go, oh, okay, I know what it is, and avoid it? Um, let's just gamble it today. So we're between sharp, stamp, and swamp. Um, let's, let's just do sharp since I've written it out. Okay. So it's between swamp and stamp. Okay. So coin, um, heads will be stamp. Tails will be swamp. It was heads. So we will do stamp. Ah, coin failed me. Oh, well. <laughs> accidentally wordled. I was, it was out of 50, 50. I knew exactly what was left. Stamp and swamp. Cool. Can't win them all. If I, if I, I mean, obviously if I had undid it, I could have, I could have easily won because I knew the answer. All right. Let's do GeoGuessr. I will do challenge links so that you can also try these if you would like. Uh, let me know if you do try them because I feel like that's fun. Um, all right. So community world. Move pan, zoom, whatever you want to do. Uh, infinite time. We are just having fun here. Um, I'm going to try to avoid moving too much just because I feel like that takes a long time when you're trying to. Let's say SA. Are we in South Africa? Does that everything? Does anything else line up with South Africa? Yeah. For Oh, no, wait, no. Give way. Ooh. See, I used to have memorized the black or the, the red text on give way signs as being Australia or New Zealand, but we also, we have Australian bollards. So we are in Australia. So SA is going to be Southern Australia, not South Africa. Um, 
so the South Southern Australia ambulance service is what that says. And then this says, I don't know, maybe I should have put, maybe in the next map I'll do no move just for fun. Um, it's because I don't really feel like moving anyway. So Southern Australia is a, is a state. Um, so we're probably in Adelaide, like just statistically, right? So let's just click on Adelaide. Oh, we were not. Okay. Uh, not too bad for Australia though. So where, where was this? Uh, path, pathway, pathway. There's a D there. Pathway. All right. Cool. Well, let's move on. Maybe I could have seen mountains or something. Um, hello, person. Ooh, umbrella. Okay. Um, what does this feel like? We got palms. A lot of palms. Um, is this? We're we're are we walking? Oh no. This is a trekker. Okay, so cement roads usually means Philippines. I'm not totally against a Philippines guess here. So let's do it. Let's do Philippines. Um right here. I don't know where in Philippines to guess, so I'll just do something centrally. Not Philippines. Oh, we were in Sri Lanka. Okay, well, I don't think I had any chance of guessing Sri Lanka for that one. Oops. All right, next one. All right, our sun is south. Um, ooh, we got a sign here. Is that Cyrillic? I'm surprised. Um... So we have Cyrillic and Latin characters. Um, European signage. So we're we're like Bulgaria or Serbia. I don't know what this looks like to me. Um. Can't really tell anything about the plate. I mean, it's just, I think, a standard European plate. Um, okay, we've got mountains to the south. Pretty far. All right, I'm going to go Bulgaria. I'm going to go like northern Bulgaria because I see this, this sort of mountainous region here. Okay, I mean, I got the country right. <laughs> cool. Um, what do we learn before we, before we rotate? A little bit of hillage into the north. This sign here is interesting. I don't know what it means though. We've got white lines, single white line in the center and white lines on the outer edge. All right, let's turn. I don't think that helped me much. Got these gutters here. Let's take a closer look at this sign. Is that a is that a Spanish hunting sign? I'm gonna go with my instinct that this is a Spanish hunting sign. I don't know where that came from, but it was a Portuguese hunting sign. Okay, no hunting sign. I mean, uh, you know what? Closer than than you might expect. All right. Um, okay, so I'm seeing yellow reflectors on this but i'm also seeing an american plate so this just looks like i don't know arizona new mexico do we have any hints could it could even be california um we have the little bumps on the lane change we have train train tracks here and like a little I don't know it's like a mine maybe hmm 
The plates are white. That says Texas. I think we might be in Texas then. Okay. Big trucks. <laughs> I can't believe that just said Texas the whole time. All right, I'm going to go Texas then. Um, ooh, Texas is huge, though. You can still lose a lot of points on Texas. I, I have no idea how to like region guess Texas. Uh, we've got we got mountains all around. It's deserty. Um, I don't know. I'm thinking near New Mexico. Let's just click like around here-ish. And I could look for train tracks, but I, I feel like that's kind of silly. You know what? Uh, we were in Mexico, apparently. Uh, I'm going to look at that again. This is Mexico, apparently. Um, was there any clue that it was Mexico and not America? <laughs> this didn't help. Um, oopsie, didn't mean to do that. Um, I don't, I don't know how to tell that this was Mexico. Maybe someone can tell me. All right, let's let's uh oh that's our, that's the fifth one. Okay. 17k. Uh let's do one more. Um I'm going to turn on no move for that one just for funsies. So, I'll make a second challenge link here. And we will turn on no move. All right. And we'll save off this link. Okay. Start game. All right. So we can still pan, we just can't move. Hello, sir. Where are we? Europe somewhere, would be my guess. Um, we've got Spanish style roofs, right? I don't know. We saw these same roofs in Bulgaria though. Uh ooh. That looks does that look Portuguese? I can't tell, honestly. We've got basketball. Interesting. I don't see any stripe on the license plate. Um, same thing here. No stripe on the license plate. Let's look at this more closely. Now I'm confused. Um, and we've got, um, this road is not paved with asphalt. It's paved with concrete. I'm getting island vibes. See, we have an antenna on our car. We're driving on this, <laughs> on this um, asphalt road or concrete road. I mean, um, or what am I saying? I don't know. I don't know what word I'm using anymore. Uh, I don't know. I gotta guess somewhere. Maybe a Greek island. I don't know, I'm completely. <laughs> I'm just. <laughs> All right. It was. It was just Croatia, apparently. Who knew? <laughs> All right. It didn't look Greek to me, but <coughs> I didn't know where else to go because of the plates. The plates weren't. The plates weren't European, or not EU, but at least. Okay, we got a white car with no antenna. I don't, I don't know the meta well enough anymore. Don't play this game every day anymore. Um, that's an interesting poll. I bet it tells me everything I need to know. Um, unfortunately, I don't even know what continent we're on. Is there a sun somewhere? <laughs> Is that the sun? Might be. In which case, it's north. White car, northern sun. Ooh, look at these mountains in the distance. That's cool. Um, some big mountains to the north. Like that helps me. Uh, foliage is is interesting too. Are these evergreens. 
I, I cannot connect where we are. Um, we got a wooden fence with bar barbed wire. Wooden fence poles, I mean. Where are we? Like, if I had even an inkling of a guess, like maybe South Africa. But the, the, the foliage does not look South Africa to me. Not, not that I would trust myself on that, but like, come on, these are. These feel, this feels northern. So maybe I don't trust the sun. I don't know. And what's with this pole? Uh, could it be Australia? It doesn't look Australia to me. It doesn't look anything to me. I don't know. I guess we'll learn where this is. <laughs> um, maybe it's like super northern. It doesn't, it doesn't look like anywhere that I would guess super northern, though. Like, like I'm thinking like. Norway, Sweden, Finland, Greenland, Iceland, Canada, but oh, maybe it is Canada. Maybe it is Canada. I don't know. Nope. You know, I was going to say bottom of Chile or Argentina, but the trees threw me off. I should have gone with my instinct there. Um, I got the right hemisphere. CCP eighty two. This is this has been really hard. We got a lot of mailboxes here. Double white line in the center of the road. No outer lines. Gen two. Gen two camera. I don't know. What's with the the tree trunk <laughs> pole? Where is this? Ch Chile. Oh, CCP to mailboxes. I feel like I am completely lost on this game. Um, Gen two. Where's the sun? Sun is north. I feel like I have to go Australia here. I don't know why. Just click around here. Okay. Okay. Immediately feels European. Yeah, we've got the EU license plates as well. The blue stripe on the left. Uh, we've got this these hanging lights from the power lines. Ooh, we have a Skavangisveg. Yeah, so this is Denmark, right? Denmark. Um, let's just click over here. Okay. Next. Last round. Uh, Tafiti? Is that, does that say Tafiti? That looks European. Ooh, it's very flat. Little antenna there. Those are trees. Okay. Um, the language is throwing me off here. We have a mustache sign. Ooh, some architecture back there. What am I looking at? I don't know. <laughs> 
I've been so lost today in GeoGuzzer. I feel like I'm not normally this lost, but I don't know. Clearly it's this this little lavender flower here that's going to save the day. I don't know. I feel like the language on this sign is probably the most helpful thing, but I don't I don't quite get what language that would be. I might not even be reading it right. Super flat. When it's this flat, like, I don't know. I don't think this would be Netherlands, though, but Netherlands is really flat. Um, the little antenna. Who does, who does the mustache sign, like, yellow like that with a wooden pole? Oh, I'm going to click, like... Somewhere around here. Hungary, Serbia. See, I didn't see Cyrillic. We have a Y at the end of this word. Tafiti. Who does that? Is the sun north? No, the sun is south. Yeah, we're in Europe, right? I've kind of been assuming you're up. I wonder if these houses are helpful. Not to me. Very long barn or something or house. Look, at, look how big that is. Um, The Y at the end of that name is really throwing me off. And I don't know if it should be or not, but. I'm just going to click on Hungary, and it's, it's so wrong, but all right, where were we? Poland. Okay. I don't... Well, what is the name of this road? Because I feel like that's what we were looking at. I guess, I guess we don't get to learn. <laughs> um, I, I don't know how to identify that as Poland. Anyway. Oof, really bad score. I'm, I think we're going to do one more. Might as well just do one more. Let's do another no move. See how it goes. I need to stream this more so people can give me the, the tips. <laughs> All right. Um, can't read the sign. These poles are weird. I don't think I've seen poles like this before. I've seen polls like that. Ooh. Ooh, plate is weird too. Oh, we got Spanish? No, is, is that even Spanish? I don't think so. Portuguese? Wait, where? <laughs> Black car. Could we be in Argentina? Hold on. Is this Spanish or? Black car makes me think Argentina. And a few other things are lining up with that. The language on the sign is confusing me, though. But we've got... um. Again, we got black car. Is that really all I'm going off of? I feel like there was more. Oh yeah, the plate kind of looks like it's got that black dot in the center, right? That's like an Argentinian plate. When it's blurred, it looks like there's a black dot in the center, I should say. All right, so Argentina is huge though. Um. I don't have any clue. It's not a very major road. Well, it might be. Who knows? The road is um kind of going almost north. And I'm just gonna click like like around here. 
I got the country right. It was just near Buenos Aires. <laughs> if I just clicked on Buenos Aires, it would have been better. Okay. <clears throat> Double yellow. This no front plate. This looks like we're in either in Amer uh, U.S. or Canada. Um. Yeah, is that a yellow plate? Might be. Are there any fronts of signs I can see? Apparently, okay, we've got a no turn, no left turn sign. Um, there are both states and provinces with no front plate. And unfortunately, with no front plate, I don't have plate info. I do have I do have these plates that are very far away. And covered by a fence, <laughs> and then a sign covered by a tree and a fence. Um, we got kind of this rusted barrier here. Is there anything that can let me distinguish? Okay, we got we got this water feature over here to the south. More cars here. Highway sign. I'm I'm leaning towards like southern US. I don't know, we've got we've got bump bumps on the Is that is that a bumpy do a bumpy do? Um I don't know, I'm going to go like who I don't I don't know who exactly has um you know, lake would be in we would be, be would we be in Michigan <laughs> with all the lakes? Um, I think Michigan was one of the states without a front plate. So let, let's try that. Okay, we were we were in New Jersey. Looks like. Okay, fair enough. Okay, we are we are in the Netherlands because of the plates, right? And the the sign okay someone's on a bike yeah very netherlandsy okay um let's just click in the middle okay cool that was an easy one i recognize the plates um the yellow with the blue stripe plates okay this pole doesn't have anything going on it's just got wires coming out of it um very interesting antenna that's got a twisted here Only I remembered all the metas. Wait, it's on both. We have an antenna on both sides. That's crazy. <laughs> okay. Um, mailboxes. I don't know where we are. I don't. Know. <laughs> I think that's the game, though. I think the game is the, you don't know where you are and you try to figure it out. Um, solar panels. Okay. I got a plate back there. Looks like a long plate, at least. We've got this um, Spanish roof architecture. I don't even know if it's proper to call it Spanish, but where are we? Now that doesn't look like a long plate at all. Wait. I wish I could find the sun. I, th I think it's this way, north. Where is this? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> It feels like we're in North or South America. Maybe South America because of where the sun is. But the pole is throwing me off. This, we have a short plate here, small plate. 
So like my initial thought was like Mexico. But we have Northern Sun, and I don't I don't know, would Mexico have poles like that? I don't know. Okay, well I gotta guess somewhere. Maybe I go like Colombia. No, that's not a Colombian plate, right? Who's got small plates? Peru, maybe? I don't know. This is wrong. We are in Australia. In Adelaide? How could how could I have gotten Australia there? I didn't know Australia did polls like that. Was there any clue about driving left? I guess yeah, I don't know where the front of the car is. Might be a one-way street. I can't tell. I don't think I can tell this is drive left. Maybe the signs are on the Oh, we had a we had a street sign here that I completely missed. Um that might have helped. It was blurred. I don't know that I could tell that this was drive left if I was looking for that. Um There's no stop sign or anything, so I don't know if this street sign would have tipped me off. Um, oops. Okay. Well, let's go to the next one. <clears throat> we have, are those horses or cows? Maybe cows. Can't really tell. Yikes. This one, this has been really hard today. We have a Northern sun. Looks like a cow. Um, this I think is South America. Um, any, any hints? Uruguay? No. Chile? Maybe I'll go Peru again. Oh, it was Brazil? Okay. I'm, I'm not very good at this, am I? Okay. You know what? I'm going to do one more because that, that doesn't feel good to end on that one. So we're just going to, we're just going to keep doing it. <laughs> okay. Grab that link. This will be the last one, though. Even if I do horribly, it'll be the last one. I'm going to end the video. Okay, what do we got going on here? That looks like a Florida plate to me. Saint Stinkin' Cute. Market shops. Where is it? Georgia. That might be a Georgia plate with the, pe with the peach. Pet Boys, Elm Street. Is that a Georgia plate or a Florida plate? I don't know. Any other clues here? The foliage doesn't remind me of Florida, so I'm going to go Georgia. Um, maybe near Atlanta. It was, it was Florida, but it was the panhandle. Okay. Could have been worse. Um, interesting. Toli Toli. Huh. Is this Indonesia or Thailand? I, or, or Malaysia? The plate. The plate's got the, the black and white sections to it. Ooh, we have a Thai flag. That helps. Okay, so we're in Thailand. Ooh, some pretty buildings. Um, I wonder if Toli Toli is findable in Thailand. <coughs> I don't know where to be looking. Are we just in Bangkok? <coughs> Jeez.
I don't know if Toli Toli would be like a district of Bangkok or if it's its own city or municipality. I don't know what they would call it. Um, all right, I'm just going to click on Bangkok. That's fine. Wait, it was Indonesia. Did I get my Indonesia and Thai, Thai flex? I got my Indonesia and Thai flex confused. Oh, it is listed as Toli Toli on the map. Very hard to find though, because it's this random island over here. Um, oops, that was that was an Indonesia flag. Oh, it's been so long since I did this regularly. This is embarrassing. Um. You know, I knew it was between Indonesia and Malaysia based on the license plate, and I, I just got the the flag confused me because I had it wrong in my head. Enchanted Rock, the power is on. That's English. Is that, is that a hint? Where's the sun? The sun is to the south, so we're in the northern hemisphere. We got palm trees. We got stop signs. English small plates. We're just in the U.S. again. I would believe this is U.S. What are these plates? Trash can help? Not really. Um, this is Enchanted Rock. So who uses Enchanted Rocks to power their city? Um, I don't know. Palm trees? Doesn't feel California to me. So I'm going to go Florida. It was Texas on the Mexican border. What city is this? Del Rio? Is that the city? Wow, I, would, I don't think I would have guessed Texas there. Interesting. Okay. Fuji color. I think we might be in. <laughs> I think we might be in Japan. What do you think? Um, why am I looking as if I'm going to figure out where in Japan we are? Uh, all right. For the memes, I'm going to go Obama Japan. Obama. Here we are. All right. <laughs> um. Bangladesh? I'm thinking Bangladesh. Let's just do it. Uh, was it? Yeah, it, I think so. <laughs> yeah, it was Bangladesh. Okay. Darn. Not a, not a great one again. So that was the last one, but I'm going to do one more. I, I am so embarrassed by getting the, the flag mixed up. I hate it. It's going to haunt me. Um, okay. Fifth game. What are we doing here? <sighs> Nothing is helpful to me. I've got these red and white chevrons here that's what you want to call those this plate is throwing me off but it's a truck plate so i don't know what to do with it where's the sun the sun is south maybe ish south ish what am i looking at <laughs> What continent am I on? <laughs> I feel like it's South. Uh, I feel like it's Mexico. Is it Mexico? I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to think how the, the sun is south. Hold on. Are we even in the Americas? Maybe. Yeah, what well, single yellow solid line, no outer lines. I need to rem I need to like re 
restudy the the street lines or something. I don't know. I usually just learn it through exposure, but it's hard to remember. Wait, or is that the sun? Uh, yeah, that's the sun. Um, I don't know. I'm I'm so lost. Does this help? Macapel. There's a lot of things saying Macapel. That and that say Macapel. What does that? What language is that? Could we be in Europe? Is that like even a possibility? You know what? I am going to go North Macedonia. That was purely based on I thought I saw a little sky rift in the sky. Okay. Um, Kenya, Nigeria, Nigeria. Do we have a follow car? We do. We've got the UDA Uda. I think we're in Nigeria. Just this, this truck is pretty distinctive. Um, okay. Well, let's trust that then. Let's go near Abuja. No, it was Kenya. I'm gonna look at it again. This is different footage. Um, there's some way to switch, but I don't. I don't remember how. Um, there we go. Was this, no, this is moving me or I don't know. Anyway, it <clears throat> doesn't matter. <coughs> that was Kenya. <clears throat> okay. Whoa, there's a helicopter. <coughs> Antenna, pretty big one. Guy on a bike. What is what is that red star signifying? I don't know. I feel like I should. My and my initial instinct right now is Russia. Something is telling me this is Russia. <clears throat> so I guess let's go Russia. <clears throat> Just go near Moscow. Okay, it was Russia. Not a terrible guess. I mean, <laughs> you can lose way more points than that in Russia. All right. Um, what? We can't see the car at all. The sun is south. That actually surprises me. Uh, what? I can't read what this says. This is another one where I'm just going to get the wrong continent. We've got like a gravelly road too. What clue can I use here? Got a building there. I feel like this is probably the biggest clue, but I don't know what it's trying to tell me. These trees are like planted really far apart. And I got a grid. They're kind of short too, and short and squat trees. Where is this? I don't see any any clue that's going to help me here. 
I see a copyright 2019 Google here. So this is 2019 footage. Um, how do people see that without zooming? Where was it? It's here. It's not. It's not even. It's not even visible unless you zoom. I don't know what people are looking for when they find the copyright. Maybe it's not that. Maybe there's some other way to see it. Um. It's all over the sky too. Maybe that's how you see it. Yeah, you can see it in the sky here. Um, anyway, I don't think 2019 helps me because I don't have any of the dates memorized. This is, this is another one I'm just going to get completely wrong. I don't know where to go. With no car visible at all, no color, no antenna, no nothing. That makes me think US. And what I've been trying to think is whether any of this actually could possibly be US. I don't see how. Like what? That, that isn't English. But I don't know. I can't like it's, it's slanted. Like I can't, I can't read the letters. But I feel like that says day. Like are we Spanish? D-E here. Does that look like D-E? I don't know. We got like maybe a Z there. So could we be in Mexico? I don't know. I'm going to guess Mexico, I guess. It could be Spain. But I feel like Spain would have a car visible in some way. I don't know. Let's just click deserty Mexico, like up, up here. Okay. It was Spain. Darn it. <laughs> At least I mentioned Spain. I don't know. Ugh. I'm never going to have a good round, am I? Um, I'm just not good enough to have a good round on this map. I feel like they made this map harder. Maybe I'm just bad now. I, I mean, we can see our shadow, but we can't see the car again. Um, just your standard bare pole there. Which apparently, I don't know what that means. But then this one's not bare. What is this building here? Huh. I have a dilapidated building. Just a dirt road in every direction. Where's the sun? Sun is north. Is there any way to tell which way I'm driving? <laughs> I mean, we're facing this way, but like, I feel like we're driving in the middle of the road. I don't really see us preferring one side or the other. Could be drive right. I feel like that's a bike facing us, but I could be imagining things. Um, I don't know. South America somewhere is my initial thought. But we can't see the car. It's frustrating. I don't know what to do here. Well, let's just go somewhere in South America. Um, Brazil, maybe? Where was it? It was Argentina. Okay. <sighs> 11K even worse let's do one more <laughs> i don't know i don't want to end on 11k i want to end on a good round but i guess i'm not good enough to have a good round i have to get very lucky uh is that arabic no i think we're in bangladesh are we are we in india um Bangladesh, India, not Sri Lanka. This could be uh, some of that new India footage that I've never seen. 
Um, that's what I'm thinking. But the problem is India's huge, and I don't know where to go. But let's just click up here. Okay, was it India? No, it was Bangladesh. Darn it. Okay. Um, got kind of a white. This reminds me of the Chile car. <laughs> like, where's the sun? South Southern Sun. Oh no. Well, you wouldn't have a Southern Sun in Chile. Well, <laughs> another good round, huh? What are they doing? What is this location? Mexico? This was UAE, apparently. Probably was some way I would have known that. I don't know. Three points. Um, this is Australia. Hurst Glen. I, at least I remember Australian bollards. <laughs> We're driving left. So that reinforces Australia. Um, I don't know where Hurst Glen, like, it's just the name of a street. <laughs> so, uh, Australia's, I could, I could get two points in Australia. Um, last time we had these double white lines in Australia, where was that? Is that, I don't know, I'll just click around here. Okay, so Brisbane. So this the state was um Queensland, I guess. Okay. Uh black and yellow pole with does that that used to say stop, maybe? <laughs> um interesting. I say that, but I have no idea what's going on. Because if that if that actually said stop, I see S T O P. Then I'm very confused. Where's our sun? Sun is north. It's on the left. So we're driving left. Maybe we're in South Africa. South Africa or um, what's that country called? Uh, Botswana. I'll just hedge it up here near Pretoria. Okay, it was Botswana. Okay. Um, double yellow lines. This is pretty. Somewhat pretty. <laughs> Western sun doesn't help me. No car. Oh, we got a little bit of a a little bit of a car visible here. It's like a white car. We're driving right. We've got double yellow lines. We've got little reflectors on the double yellow. Huh. Got these big electricity poles. Where was the sun? Hard to say. It's just west. Wow. Um, interesting. I don't know where this is. I'm going to go like here in Chile. Okay, it was Bolivia. Interesting. Near La Paz. Okay, <laughs> even worse this time. I don't know. I feel like I'm getting, I mean, other than the UAE guess, I'm getting close, but like wrong country or wrong state. Wrong, wrong state. Wrong country, wrong country, wrong country. Like getting a neighbor every time. I don't know. 
No one's watching this anymore, but I'm going to keep going. Might as well keep making challenge links. <laughs> okay. I have to stop soon, though. Does that say zero, zero kilometer or something? A625. I've just, I've lost everything. Nor Northern Sun. I don't know. I'm thinking Argentina on this one. This was Chile. Okay. Neighboring country again. Uh, wh where is this? Transformers? Ooh, we've got the black and yellow thing there. I think this might be Taiwan. So let's go Taiwan. Just click middle. Nope. <laughs> it was Japan. Was that low cam? Darn it. Okay. It's Japan. Um black car. I don't know. I, it, it, to me, it's feeling like this game has changed significantly since I last played. I don't know. Black car with this black dot in the middle is just making me think we're in Argentina. I can't find the sun. So I guess I'll just go Argentina. Um, let's just go in Buenos Aires. Nope. We were. Malaysia. I'm getting worse. Black car. This time are we in Argentina? Looks more Argentina A to me now. Yes, finally. Something correct. Oh, I'm doing so bad. Southern Sun? What's this? What the heck? What what vehicle are we on? Are we on like a bus? <laughs> um Okay, so the satellite dishes are like pointed like horizontal. So we're like equatorial here. Um Um I think we're, I want to say Southeast Asia, but like, I'm not getting the right vibes off the foliage and the, I don't know. So, some of them are, what is going on here? Where am I? I don't know. I'm so lost. Like the yellow. The foliage doesn't feel Southeast Asian to me, but some parts of it do feel Southeast Asian to me. We're driving right. No front plate. Like, could this just be like, I don't know, Panama or Guatemala? Is there any language? I think I think I have to go like Central America here. Let's go Guatemala. Okay, it was Panama. Of course, it's it's always the other country that I mention. I'm never going to do well, am I? There's too much to remember in these days. For for me to be able to do well on these. How many of these am I gonna do? I don't know. I wanna go until I'm satisfied. This is Israel, that's Hebrew. Um Gedera? Bear Shev Bear Hmm. Oh look, it's on the map. So how far from Beersheba are we? Um, 
Well, it's 76 kilometers southwest. What what the road we're on is going southwest. Um on 40. And then what was the other one? Get Gadera. Does that show up on the map? So if we're going south southwest, then we're northeast of Beersheba. 40. I mean this this road. Um we're going southwest on it. Where does this road go southwest? Hold on, let's let's do this. Um, let's line up north here. So this is north. So the road is, yeah, the road's going this way. Where does it do that? It does it here, but then we would not be going to Beersheba, going southwest. Or is it saying that we're, we're is it saying we're on the 40 or I think this says we're on 40 or maybe it's saying the exit is 40 and we're not on 40. I don't know. I mean, this is going to be close enough, but this is not where we are. Maybe we're up here. Maybe this works. And we're on an entrance. Um, so maybe here. Oh, not even close. I did not quite understand how far away 70 kilometers was in Israel. What the heck? Okay. I mean, that is the correct direction. Whoa. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I just didn't, I didn't have the sense of scale corrupt at all. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I should have realized that was much farther away. Um, never mind. Uh, white paint on the bottom of trees. Car does not have an antenna. We are driving right with European plates. Maybe? Well, there are certainly long plates. I, I think I see blue there, but I don't see blue there, or maybe there's blue there. I don't see a plate at all there. There might be blue there. Crosswalk. Is that four lines? I don't know. Ooh, we've got the, the yellow border around the crosswalk. I usually associate that with Russia or Ukraine, but I'm not seeing. Could this be Russia? Is there, what would I look for? It's not, it's not the Russian crosswalk, though with the three lines in the Stratton Man. So I think that maybe other countries do that. I'm not seeing any language anywhere. It's unfortunate, but can't always depend on finding language. Um, okay, so... Romania, Hungary, Serbia, Bulgaria, I'm thinking this area. Um, could it be Poland? I don't, I don't really have any good hints here. Let's go Romania. Okay, I got it right. Near Bucharest. Okay. Phew. Ash Avenue. We've got a, we've got a, City crest. Madison emergency room. Maine and I mean that you this is five K ball. We're in the US obviously. <laughs> um no front plate. Madison. Is that the region or is that just like a brand name for the hospital? I don't think I can 5k this. I think that someone could, someone better than me could 5k this. Or with, with Google, you certainly could. Like that's not, there's no doubt about that. Um, you just Google that sign and you're good. Um, but that's not what I mean. We've got fall foliage, no front plate.
Are any of these other flags helpful? I can't really recognize them. This red one stands out. I don't know all the state flags anyway. Um, okay, so I'm thinking this area, like the southern, southeastern US. Why does Madison, Wisconsin, like, come into my brain? I'm not seeing it. Oh, there is a Madison, Wisconsin. All right, I'm going to click on that. <laughs> okay. It was Idaho. <laughs> um, place isn't even called Madison. It's just Madison Memorial Hospital. Okay. That's pretty funny. Um, well, I got, I, you know what? Wisconsin was closer than where I was going to guess earlier. So Idaho. Okay. That is Idaho, isn't it? Not Montana. Yeah, I think it is. Mo it's not Wyoming or Montana. Yeah, it's Idaho. Okay. Ooh, what's going on here? Interesting. Interesting boat. <sighs> You gotta throw me one of these when I'm feel like I'm doing okay. I mean, I'm not doing amazing, but what is this car even? It's got <laughs> like I feel like this is just one of those where you know it or you don't. Uh, oh, we got a flag. What is that flag? It's not the Indonesia flag, I don't think. What's this say? Can't tell. It's not readable. I don't have enough. Um, I'm just going to go Indonesia anyway. Uh, we got some kind of weird pier, but we're heading south to, I mean, I don't know if that helps me. Um, I don't know. Let's just go over here for no reason. It was Philippines. Was that the Philippine flag? You know what? I got closer than I could have, for sure. Um, I'm surprised that's Philippines, to be honest. Let's see. We got a little antenna on our car. We've got white paint on the bottom of our pole that says box. So we're we're leaving box. My my initial thought is Russia, but I'm not 100% on that. I can't tell what's going on with that plate, but I don't see any blue. The problem with Russia, of course, is you can get two points and still be in Russia. Um, I'm just going to click over here in case it might be European. Oh, no, it was. Where is this Albania? OK. That was Albania, apparently. All right, that's going to be it. <laughs> I can't do it anymore. I'm done. Um, I don't know. I feel like I, I have to like re relearn all the meta. I got confused so many times. How do you how do you even do it? OK, I mean, you just got to keep playing and you got to try to remember what what each location felt like and what you were seeing in there. And I'm, I'm not not really doing that uh, anyway. Uh, hope you enjoyed this. <laughs> I know that was a lot of GeoGuessr games. I'm sure not every, most people didn't watch it and that's fine. Um, hope you enjoyed it if you did. And if you did, then why not leave a like, subscribe and a kind comment below.